you. So we're at the end of the hallway, so it's really quiet. Extra deadbolt there. And you first walk in, and there's an extra chain for security. The bathroom is to the right. Plenty of space, lots of room here. I have extra towel storage on the floor and on the wall. So like I said, plenty of space, even inside the shower. Three cabinets worth of storage, room for garbage can, etc. The next room over is the bedroom. So you have the closet doors open, so there's shelving on that side. These shelves go all the way across. The ceiling is also very high, so there's lots of room. I have two bins tall storage in there. Um, there's even enough room for me to have two shoe racks and a printer because there's an outlet right here. So I leave the printer in there so it's not so much of an eyesore. I have a full size bed and there's plenty of room for it to fit this way facing the window. You can also put it along this wall depending on the side of the bed frame. My bed frame was a little bit too wide. Um, I have tons of room. I used to have my desk here when I worked from home full time. So I would be able to pull a chair out and still have enough space. Um, I used to have that bookshelf there. So there's plenty of different ways you could decorate and rearrange and it's a beautiful view right of outside. Um, and then this is the main room here. So I have a pretty big sectional as well as some table storage when I first walk in, place to store my mask. Um, I don't remember the measurements of the room, but I can look it up if anyone needs. I have plenty of room for a bar cart, fans, etc. all of that. Um, and then on this side, now I work from home sometimes, so I have a smaller desk set up and I kind of have it tucked away here and then the ottoman fits perfectly right here. So this ottoman actually fits in to the section of the couch here for it to become the size of a king size bed. The back folds down. This is from Wayfair. Um, it retails about $600 and this piece and this piece here are all like lift up storage. So there's a ton of room. Um, I'm willing to sell those as well for pretty cheap. The table I, I won't be bringing, the marble tables I won't be bringing. So even the desk, there's a lot of things that I am willing to definitely get rid of. Um, and then, so then this is the stairs to go outside. I have the TV mounted on this wall so that it's tucked out of the way when I'm coming and going during the day, but it does pull out um, with a perfect view for the couch. Um, this is a full size kitchen. It's a little messy right now. So I'll post a separate video of that. Um, like a little bit later on, but there's plenty of storage and it, uh, plenty of outlets, etc., over there. Um, so when I tuck the TV back in, then I can go outside. I have this magnet screen thing, which I'm also happy to leave. And this lets on right to the terrace. So there's a ton of space out here. I have, you know, these chairs facing. This is the area that gets the most sunlight. Um, in the summer around this time, it's usually sunny out here until like three, four o'clock. It goes away for a little bit and then comes back for about an hour, um, so it's really nice. I can leave all of these things. I'd be happy to sell all of these to anyone incoming. These windows open, so there's plenty of ventilation. I have the door always propped open so that I can get some air. Um, and there's plenty of storage space for chairs, decorations, etc. That's a bar cart that stays out here. Um, I plan on spray painting it, but I never got around to it, so I have the spray paint. If that's anyone uh, wants that as well. This storage bin I can leave as well. This has plenty of room in it for some additional chairs. I have garbage, a hose. There's a hose connection that the neighbors control on that side. So we just ask them to turn it on and off if you need to water any plants. I don't have any plants, um, so I really just use it when I wanna clean up the terrace. So there's really nice neighbors on both sides. They're actually leaving in July. Uh, and then this is the beautiful unobstructed view tiki torches that I'm probably not supposed to have. So this building is Cipriani and so they'll never build any taller than this. So for as long as you live here, this will always be the beautiful view. This overlooks William Street um, and that's the East River kind of tucked in through those buildings over there. So this is like Water Street heading down that way. So there's plenty of views. Um, all the neighbors are really nice, the ones down the row here, as well as the ones upstairs. They're all really nice, very quiet, very friendly. Um, and so this is the whole space. If there's anything I missed, again, I'll do another video for the kitchen. If there's anything I missed, just uh, send me a text message and I'll try to capture it. Thank you.